Welcome back to Class Farms, guys. Kai over here, and we've got Matt with us. What's up, everybody? All right, today we're going to talk about the all new Tucker Rove. Well, new, but there's a little catch to that. All new Tucker Rove USA TX3 pump action shotgun over here, which is labeled ANP. What does that mean, Matt? So that's the Afghan National Police. So this is a really cool limited quantity kind of run. So what happened was the uh, US government during their kind of uh, stewardship in Afghanistan, mm -hmm. uh, they put in a request to the manufacturer in, in Turkey for Tucker of USA. And okay. they, uh, they ordered some shotguns to arm their national police. And so they started building these uh, shotguns and unfortunately then the u.s forces had to withdraw from afghanistan okay uh, which meant there was a changeover in the government of afghanistan and and the manufacturer was basically left holding these shotguns with no person to take them so they worked with the importer who brings tucker of usa shotguns mm -hmm. in and were able to get them into the u.s and luckily we got a hold of them from the importer. And so what's very important about this is there are only 250 of these produced for that contract and that's all that will be made. That's what I was saying, new, but there's a catch to that. So yes, these are brand new. They're made specifically for the Afghan National Police as you can see over here. However, not used at all, only 250 of them. And we got our hands on them. So once they're depleted, that's, That's it. it. There's no more. Yeah. Uh, so as far as the model of the shotgun, it is yeah. the Toker F TX3, which has many of the same kind of features and controls as a Remington 870, which is fantastic. You know, it's definitely built to be a duty shotgun for a police force. I mean, when I was in the state police, we had those type of um, 870 and yep. they're obviously known for it. So it's for their durability. Yep. So it's got a lot of really kind of uh, nice features. So if we look here across the top, you'll see that it has a ghost ring rear sight with a fiber optic mm -hmm. front sight, which makes acquiring kind of your target picture very, very fast. Yep. Um, like also, yeah, we have a Picatinny mount on top. So in, you wanted to put some kind of a red dot or other kind of you know, aiming assistance on there, you definitely could. Uh, it comes with the magazine extension. So this will hold five plus one rounds. Uh, six, sorry, plus, six plus six one plus rounds. One, exactly. Six plus yep. one rounds. Uh, so you can put all six in the magazine and then one extra in the chamber. It's got this really nice Turkish walnut furniture. That isn't a really nice dude. It actually, this is real. It's not synthetic. So it, it feels really good. Looks really good too. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Now you'll notice that it has, does have sw sing, swing, <laughs> sling swivel, swivel exactly on the front and the rear and the shotgun does come with a nylon sling talk about sl uh, sling which yeah. is really nice yeah yeah it's a nice branded yeah. sling um and so you just end up with a shotgun that has a lot of features already baked into the package when you receive it and of course it's got this nice crest here from the afghan national police uh also on and the stock it has a yeah. rack number so you'll know exactly which one of the limited quantity that you have. Yeah. So here we have model number 39 and I have number 37. You know so what I if, like? If you see it out there, you know, you'll know which shotgun you have. This is really cool. What I like is this cool heat shield. Yes, absolutely. It really is. It actually looks pretty cool. Like, but it's obviously efficient, but it also looks really yeah, cool too. So under use, you know, it should help uh, reduce yeah. some of that kind of heat shimmer coming off yeah. of a hot barrel. Um, but yeah, you know, this is a fantastic little package. And uh, I think we're gonna get some trigger time on it. I think we should, yeah, man. I've got some double out bucks. Uh, we can use those. And yeah, I think we got maybe some bird shot and just test out a couple different loads. Yeah. But uh, you know, basically, uh, yeah, th this is the shotgun, and we're really excited to have it. So I, I'm really excited to shoot it. Exactly. I really like the capacity too. Look, mm -hmm. six plus one. Mm -hmm. That's one extra, dude. And capacity <laughs> is very important in my opinion. Well, so. especially with a shotgun, considering yeah. the capacity is kind of innately so low, yep. that even adding that one extra round- It's a big deal. Is a big it's deal. a big deal, yeah. Now, if you are looking for other accessories for it, uh, it does take chokes. It takes kind of Breda slash yeah. Benelli style chokes. It comes with three. It comes with an open, improved cylinder, and a full. And then also, if this extra one round is not enough capacity for you, it will take any kind of Remington That's magazine right. extension mm -hmm. as well. So for the 870, I should say. It, yeah. So, you know, you definitely have your ability to kind of take Take this even further if you'd like but i think it comes as a great package as it is it is and it's, it's going to be a great for home defense or recreational use absolutely so yeah. so why don't we uh get loaded up and maybe take some shots down range let's do it man so matt what about those uh magazine restrictions for hunting purposes yeah so the shotgun does also include a magazine restrictor so effectively it limits the magazine capacity to a total of three rounds including the chamber so you can take it out hunting Okay, because this got six plus one, that's seven. So Yeah, so okay. you definitely need it. All right, Matt, so you've got six in the pipe, mm -hmm. one in the chamber, total of seven. Seven rounds. All right, what I want you to do is we got about 
it targets C-Zone's uh, condensed target 25 yards out. So go ahead and send all seven downrange as fast as you can. See how that feels, how that runs. All right, so this is double out buck. Okay. Let's go ahead and get it done. Go. Wow, okay. Felt good, pretty good. Yeah, I mean, you know, so obviously, you know, buckshot out of a 12 gauge, especially one that's this light, you yeah. know, it's it is pretty very light. light. Yeah. Uh, you know, it's got a bit of a recoil, but I mean, still felt good. You know, I gotta love that pump action. Well, I got bird shot in here, six in the pipe, one in the chamber. All right. Seven rounds. So let's see how that feels. All right. Same thing. It's on safe. All right, you were on target every time, so that's pretty good. How did that feel? Yeah, I mean, again, it feels really good. There's a little bit less recoil out yeah. of the bird shot, but uh, I mean, it's just, it feels great to run a pump action shotgun, right? Yeah. And there's just something about being able to, you know, work the pump and then get right back on yeah. target. Uh, you know, I've even shot skeet and stuff. Not necessarily great, but I've even done that with my, my own pump action shotgun. And I mean, it's a lot of fun. You ready to uh, take a shot? Yeah, I want to do it. So one of the benefits of a pump action shotgun is you can throw pretty much any load in there. You'll just fire it because you just get yeah, the pump You don't have yourself. to worry about like gas or inertia, exactly. you know, to drive the system. Yep. You are in control. Oh, and that. so you can pretty much shoot anything you want. Yeah. Seems like it's running pretty good. So I want to give it a shot now. All right, so. let's do it. So your turn. Let's try out the TX3 Tokro shotgun, the Afghan police model. Uh, see what you think. All right, so double up buck, double up 25 buck. yards. Let's just see how it is. One in the chamber, off safe, and let's go. <laughs> Woo! Okay. All right. All right. You she runs real good. There, yeah. All right. Now this one's got the bird shot. All right. One in the chamber. One in the chamber. All right. Off safe. You can tell just by watching the difference in recoil between the two it's, loads. It really is. And you said you, sh you shot st uh, skeet, right? Yeah. Not that great? Not that great. A lot better than me. You got three kids, I got none. But this is pretty good, dude. I really am impressed with this. I can shoot this thing real fast. Yeah, I mean, so, so again, you know, a lot of really dependable features uh, that kind of harken to yeah. a, a Rimden 870 style shotgun. You got your, uh, you know, your pump release right there yeah. in front of the trigger guard. You have your cross bolt safety right here behind the trigger guard, and it's just a really comfortable shotgun to shoot. You know, yeah. if you're used to shooting the recoil of a 12 gauge, then you shall have no problems with this. It's a really fun, uh, it does have a pretty decent yeah. rubber butt. I now. noticed that too. This is actually pretty good. Pretty just good. Right out the factory. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and so again, you know, if, if this is, this is just something that's really cool because of that limited quantity, right? Yeah. Let's talk about the heat shield, right? Yeah. Look, completely my hand is on it. Absolutely just just a little bit warm that's all nothing crazy mm -hmm. i know this is yeah it's not supposed to just make it completely go away no. but it's not bad i can hold on to it if if this wasn't there you're not touching the barrel like that so <laughs> so you know that is obviously something where if you're in a uh, a fairly close situation yeah. you know uh you're talking about like home defense and stuff there becomes becomes a bigger chance that you might actually touch that barrel right oh of course yeah. and so mm -hmm. this definitely does provide you a little bit better of a, a prolonging of of you know, how long you could possibly touch that barrel uh, when it's been fired. Yeah. Also, like I said, I think that it does a really good job if you're shooting a lot with helping to dissipate the heat so you don't end up with a bad heat barrage on top. That's uh, very good point, exactly. So, uh, it's shotgun, so it's gonna be close quarters, but I, overall, dude, I got nothing negative to say about this. I mean, I, I really like the wood, the real wood, mm -hmm. and I like the fact that this is a collector's item because it just is, 250 of them. And I got the number 39 to, from Afghan National Police, although it wasn't ever delivered. Yeah, never but delivered. That's what it was made for, right. and runs great. I don't know, man. What do you, what do you, and it comes with a sling? Yeah, if I could add one thing, it'd be a sling. Oh, wait, it comes it with It comes with a sling, you know? You just ran out of rounds, throw this to the side, get your sidearm, and finish the deal if you need to. But I believe this will get the job done. Yeah. So, I mean, I, I don't know that we could say anything uh, else about yeah. it. Obviously, uh, you know, it's, nah. it's a shotgun and shotguns are a great utility firearm. And you know where else you can find some really great firearms? Uh, if I had to guess, uh, cfcontest.com? Cfcontest, yep. All right, well, with that being said, guys, go to cfcontest.com. You're going to some, see some cool stuff. Again, if you're a veteran audience in this channel, you know exactly what I'm talking about. If you're one of those new folks out there, well, welcome, first of all. 
check out cfcontest.com. You're not going to regret what you see there. That's right. And don't forget, always come back because it changes uh, quite often. Exactly. But there's always cool stuff going on. Always. So, I don't know. I, I think that's about it, Kyle. Uh, yeah, Scott, that's it, man. If, uh, if this is, again, you're new to the channel, we appreciate you coming down. Make sure you leave a comment down below. Uh, you know, we always appreciate your feedback. God bless. And we'll see you next time at Classic Firearms.